Hello follow internet, I am Noman Islam. In this video, I am going to contribute how can you manage Android. Open up your favorite browser. Basically, Android is a tool designed to keep the control of the Android system remotely and retype informations from it. Android is a client side, also server side applications. Search Android. Hit enter. As you can see, this is the display of first tourism, github.com, this Karma9874 Android Red, GitHub repo, click here. This software is meant for educational purpose only, scroll down. You can see the documentation and also you can see pre-request Android Red require Python 3 and Java or Android Studio. I like to work with Python 3 and Java. I don't need Android Studio. Now, I'm going to open up our terminal. Now, I'm going to install Python. And also, Python 3 pip. Hit enter. It will take your password. Hit Y. Enter. You can see here this is display error unable to face some archives made on get update so hit enter this is also permission denied because we need to work in Sudo. Now this is okay as you can see here. Now I'm going to install Java sudo apt install open JDK dash a dash JDK hit enter hit y enter. Okay, our system requirements are fulfilled. We are installed Python 3 and also Java. Now go to follow the installation process. First you need to copy this is the GitHub repo. As you can see here, you can also copy from here. 
this is similar now open up our terminal go to desktop this is the github repo hit enter now this is cloning I hope you are familiar with GitHub. This is successfully cloned from this GitHub repo. Now I'm going to close this browser. And you can see it alas. This is the Android this github project folder you can see also this is here before this is not here now i'm going to android it hit enter you can see here this github repo requirements.txt we need to install a couple of library for work with this GitHub repo. With the help of pip, install dash r requirements.txt. Hit enter. This error happening because I'm using Python 3. So we need to specify it 3. Now hit enter. Now I'm going to again try to now I'm going to try to again install requirements.txt. Now you can see this is working. Before this is not work because uh, Python 3 pip this library does not install successfully. That's why this error happening. You can see successfully install ING Rock. This Android are working with this library. Also, you can see what the dependencies follow this cat comment. As you can see, this is also display PNG rock by using.
before we build our APK, we are going to configure Angirock. Open up a new tab. Search Angirock. Hit enter. This is display first version angirock.com. Go ahead. If you are working with Angirock, you need to sign up. I have already account. Log in here. When you sign up, you can see this dashboard. You can download for Linux or your operating system. It will display here. This is downloaded. Inside downloads folder, you can see this is the Angirock download file. Right click on that and extract here. You can see this is now extracted. Right click on that. Open in terminal. Now open up your browser again. This is Angirock dashboard. Scroll down. You can follow the instruction. Unzip to install. We are unzip. Now follow second step. Now I'm going to copy this authentication token and go back our terminal. Enter. As you can see, a token saved to configuration file. That means successfully configure our Angiro. Now you can close this terminal from here. And this is the main terminal from where we are download Android. Now inside Android, you can check Angirock is configured or not. Follow the comment. 